Okay, this course is minute taking and it's very important to take salient minutes from meetings, very, very important. If we don't, uh, we can cause ourselves problems in the future. Think about minutes as being a means of motivating individuals to complete agreed tasks ready for the next meeting, rather than just issuing a record of a discussion. But the other side, or the extreme, that uh, we need to consider that records or minutes of meetings are valuable, auditable documents as well in some cases. So either way, we need to make sure that minutes are um, kept or produced and they are up to date, accurate, and they actually are used effectively at the end of the day. Often minutes are rushed. We um, try and guess what individuals said post event, and we put in additional words and, and then we'll send them out and then there's an element of rework, trying to uh, ask individuals if that was a, a correct interpretation of what they said and so forth. And that can be quite a long drawn out process and to a certain degree a waste of time as well. Okay. The course itself will look at not necessarily the traditional approach of um, minute taking using shorthand and abbreviations, but look at tools and techniques based around representation. Uh, and the reason for that is, I think a very good example, is that when you're walking down the street and you see a tree, you don't write out the word tree in your mind. You see a tree. And there's tools and techniques based around representing what people said, either by drawing sketches or mind maps or rich pictures, to be able to get information down very, very quickly. And then when you return to that document to write up the minutes, the information comes out very well because you're writing about the picture that you've just record it. Yeah. So we'll look at tools and techniques, new emerging tools and techniques to allow people to um, take minutes very, very precisely, um, be able to produce them very, very quickly and make them very, very meaningful, representing the actual discussion rather than what was thought to have been discussed. If you do attend the course, um, there won't be um, only secretaries there. There may well be chair people. Um, there may well be um, individuals that just need a great understanding of how the process works and it could be individuals that are new to minute taking or could well be experienced individuals. It's for individuals who need to look at a new way of getting information down and it could be about polishing their present existing skills but very much about um, looking at new ways and techniques to be more productive. So, so the course itself focuses on uh, not only speed but obviously accuracy and making sure that the minutes taken are a true representation and make sure those are produced in a very, very efficient and a very effective way. And then being able to use those minutes is a valuable tool to reach the outcomes rather than just quite simply a record of a discussion. Yes, every individual will leave the course with um, a full set of handouts and um, results from the exercises that we undertake, but also more importantly, a personal action plan for improvement. So they'll identify, for example, things that they're going to stop doing in the future things that they will continue to do to build on good practice and possibly more importantly what things they're going to start doing so they'll have that personal action plan to work with in the future.